What is up guys? Welcome back to Clicker Tail 2. We finally have the new version 8.0. It's a Christmas miracle. We have new story, new levels, and just like with Halloween, we also have a new event. So I'm just gonna try to explore all of the new features. And the first one, of course, we're gonna go to the corner here, and we're gonna enter the Christmas event. Decorate a tree. Step one is sacrifice three wooden boxes. Um, now I don't think I have any wooden boxes. So I don't think I can actually sacrifice any. But I have an idea. Something we can do if we check my profile down there. I am rank flowy with a lot of experience. And if you press S, you can have this profile like menu now. Where you can see some statistics and stuff. But also if we go to rank rewards. There we go. So I'm rank 24 I think is flowy right now. So maybe we're gonna get some wooden boxes from these rewards. I'm just gonna open them one by one. Let's check the first one. Congrats, you got one uh, wooden box? That might be a wooden box. I think those are wooden boxes. That is awesome. Thank you, regular game studios, if that was on purpose for the people who want to do the event and need wooden boxes. That is so easy. And now I got two, I think. This is so cool. Should I just open up all the rewards? I think I'm gonna open up two more. Just to see. Yeah, you're just gonna get wooden boxes. Okay. And now we can press S again. Close it. And now we should have nine out of three. Awesome. That is so nice. So convenient. Let's just go to done. There we go. Step two. Write a really cool number that reminds you about new year. And then press done. Maybe so you can find a hint somewhere. Ah, okay. There's the hint. It's kind of obvious I was going to write that anyway. So we're going to write 2018, the new year. Awesome. And we're decorating the tree. That's so nice. It's like so nicely made. Find and collect five fireworks on the map. Okay, this is exciting. These are my favorite things about these events. The little hide and seek, I guess you can call them. Okay, so let's see. They're anywhere on the map. Fireworks. Now, as soon as I find the first one... Wait, is that it? No, that's just the candy. I was looking at something different. How does a firework look like? Like, is it obvious? Is it in the sky? Or is it, like, all over the world? I'm just gonna keep going. I should be able to find at least the first one soon. Maybe I should be a, bit, a little bit faster. Come on, a firework. Firework. Oh, there's one! Wow! I found one. This is actually really well hidden. So they're like rockets. They're like individual firework pieces. Not just like fireworks in the sky. Okay, this might be harder than the Halloween search and find thing. Because that first one was already pretty hard. And I looked through the entire map and didn't find anything like that. But it, there are only four left. So I think it's definitely possible for me. I'm not sure how long it's gonna take me, though. But now, I think... Ah, oh, there's one! That is so cool! They're actually differently sized, too. So that makes it even harder. So I really have to keep my eyes open. Maybe you guys are gonna find it before me. Let's do a challenge. Who's gonna find it first? I don't see anything here. Don't see anything here. If I miss anything, you can leave an angry comment already telling me that I'm dumb. What is that? That's nothing, right? Okay. Maybe uh, there's like a secret way to enter the temp shop. There's one. Oh, the amalgamate this ready thing actually hides it. That's sneaky. Not sure if that's intended this way, but it's definitely sneaky. There could be one here. That would be extremely difficult. I don't see anything though, so maybe not. Oh, this is gonna be hard. If there's one in Hotland, it's gonna be the hardest one to find because everything is orange and fiery already. So how the heck am I supposed to find a firework in this area? Maybe near so sorry? No. No, no, I don't see anything. Only some weird fire flowers or whatever they are. Maybe Muffet has one or maybe Alphys? That could be it. Alphys also had a pumpkin. But it doesn't seem like Alphys has any firework. So let's go. Maybe it's actually in the core somewhere. Maybe I just missed it. There is one! Right there! I think that's the fourth one. So we only need one more. I'm just gonna assume that it's maybe even in the corruption. I don't think Metaton hides anything. Maybe it's actually in the corruption. A corrupted firework. Holy crap. I guess that event, like, goes between worlds and timelines. Maybe even the corruption celebrates Christmas and New Year. Oh, oh and there's it! There, there it is! We did it! I think those were all five, right? Awesome! That was actually challenging, more challenging than the pumpkins, but fun. Oh no, the fireworks that you found are flying right into the Santa! What? 
Collect them! Oh, attack? Oh! What the heck? Oh, I, I lost. This is... This is crazy. This isn't even like a clicker tail fight. This is like a whole new game me mechanic, a game type. Collect the fireworks. They're in the same position every time. Okay, so Kara here is floating. Oh no, Kara, I'm sorry, I'm bad. Kara, oh, you can go up and down. Kara is floating around and we have to help Kara here. Avoid, I guess the snowflakes or maybe raindrops, but it's, I guess it's white. It should be snowflakes. No. Wait, same position every time? So every time until I collect it? So should I stay around here? And then it's gonna reappear here for the first one at least? That's what I- No! That's what I assume is gonna happen. Come on! Oh wow, that was bad. That was a ninja attack. I got it. Got the first one. Now the question is... Where's gonna be the second one? I'm so bad! This is actually kind of difficult if you don't pay attention like me. So the best way to do it is definitely stay at the bottom because then you have the most time to avoid the shots and you also have the most time to avoid- uh, not to avoid but to actually collect the firework. Now I'm scared. I think the next one might be on the right side just because the first one was on the left. Oh, it's in the middle! Oh, we got it! Okay, two out of five. So now I have to remember the pattern too. If I mess up, I have to remember the pattern for the future. So left, then middle, and then it's probably gonna be right. But if it's right, yeah, that's dangerous because the drops are coming from the right. Oh, God. I'm not sure what Kara's hitbox is. Oh, there it is. I knew it. Darn it. But now we can try it out. If I don't get hit, I can try and see if it repeats that same firework. Or if it goes like in a loop. Or if I actually have to do a perfect run where I have to collect all fireworks in one go. This is so fun, though. This movement is so smooth. And I... I got wrecked. Wait, two out of five collected? Does it does it stay like that? No, I think that's just a save, right? I have to do everything in one go. What was that? That was the biggest fail I've ever done. Okay, not really, but that was like the biggest fail I've ever done. I don't know, dude. I, that was actually so bad. And now I failed too. Oh my god, that attempt sucked. What? Again? Okay, I need to focus more. Actually collecting the fireworks is apparently a problem for me. I'm not that good at getting that obvious big thing. Now, maybe I can actually survive after missing a firework and then we can finally find out if it's gonna loop. Oh, no, it's not. Look. So I do need to... I either need to collect all the fireworks in one go, which would mean that I have to, like, restart manually anyway, because there's no way for me to do it anymore. Or it loops afterwards. Like, it loops through all the firework locations. Oh god, that was a barrage. Kara is having a good time. Look at that. That is amazing. And bam. I think it's actually random how the firework falls down. Like, sometimes it goes all the way, sometimes it goes straight. So you have to be a little bit careful about that. And those ice drops are, of course, always random, I think. I'm pretty sure there's no pattern there. You just have to uh, always try your best at dodging there. And... Oh, perfect! Okay, okay. Now I'm gonna stay on the left side for a bit, because that's the easiest part of, like, this area of the screen. And then when I think the firework is about to appear, I think now I should go right. And... Ah, uh, be careful. And focus on collecting it when it appears. Oh god, this is actually intense. <gasps> no, look at that! Ah, oh, that was... I, it, it really depends. Because maybe you could, like, wait. And if it's too dangerous, you just don't go. Maybe you actually have to use strategy and patience. Come on, come on, come on. We're so close. Ah, uh, we did it! Okay, now I'm just gonna go left. Because I have no idea where it is. I'm not gonna take any chances. I'm just gonna wait on the left side and wait and see where that last or where the last two fireworks are gonna spawn. I mean, if I were a game designer, I would put it on the left side now and then the final one on the right side. Oh god, that was close! Yeah! <gasps> no, Kara! I'm so sorry. Oh, I'm sorry I disappointed you. But that was so good though. That was so close. We're almost... We're almost done. Oh, nice. I have to say, this is making me not only excited for Clicker Tail, like more Clicker Tail, 
but just for like the future of Clicker Tail in terms of events. If this one, like Halloween was just, you know, as a fight, a fun fight, but still a fight. But this is so different. This is the last thing I would have expected, but it's so good. Darn it, man. That third one is such a trap. But I think as soon as I get that third one, I'm in a rather safe spot. Something that also makes this kind of hard is you want to like focus on protecting Kara. No! And if you focus on protecting Kara, you won't focus on like the thing Kara is standing on, on that little plate or whatever it is. And that is the actual hitbox. It doesn't matter if Kara is hit by any projectiles. So that kind of makes it harder. No! But I shouldn't really complain, because this actually makes it easier. Imagine if Kara's hitbox was actually the hitbox, like the entire body. That would be crazy! We got it! Okay, please! Why, damn it, I'm so bad! Oh, Kara! Oh, oh, Kara, you're so good. You're so good at collecting that. That was so good. Okay, now. Um, so where was it? In the middle, right? So I want to stay... On the left side, kind of, because it's easier, but also keep at the middle. Because I think that's where it fell down at. Holy crap, you're joking! Look at that pattern! Wait, is it getting harder? Or am I just imagining things? Because I'm freaking out. But it seems like there are more, like, drops, more projectiles as time goes on. I'm gonna sto stay on the left side. I got it! Hey! Please leave me. Do we have to survive? That's it. But I did it, right? I did it. Nice! Oh god. I'm not sure. Maybe you can get like a high score. You collected these fireworks, but the freaking Temi stole them. Buy them. Because Temi <laughs> wants to explode Santa. What's happening? Why is Temi evil? Go to Temi. Um. I'm a little scared. Look, I have five fireworks that I stole from you. Look at this Temi, though. Shady Temi right there. Yeah, maybe they are yours, but now they're mine. If you want to get them back, give me three of your mystical boxes. Press Y to give five mystical boxes. That's unfair! Press no to say- or press N to say no. I wanna see what happens. Like, if I press N, maybe there's gonna be a fight, and I wanna see that. But maybe it's only, like, a one-time chance to get something. I'm gonna try to press N, though. I'm gonna tr start with N. No? What a rude player. Instead, five mis- Five hundred- The dust. That's even worse. Press 2 to ruin your damage. Press F to pay respect. I'm gonna press F. <laughs> oh, nice meme. I already have much respect. Okay. Okay. I, I got wrecked. I got absolutely wrecked. This Temi just wrecked me. That was a diss. Okay. Now 500 dust is kinda mean. So I'm gonna try to press 2. I hope it only like takes away like a flat damage. Like 20 damage, 30 damage, or maybe half. But not like everything. But I'm gonna try it. I'm gonna press 2. And I'm scared, but what's gonna happen? Oh! I'm not that evil to ruin your damage, though. Oh, really? Okay, that's kind of nice. So I have to give away 500 dust. That's kind of sad, but I guess I have to do it. Cool, but that's not enough. You know that these annoying dogs are our most evil enemy? Could you find at least six? Um, I, I, I don't know if I have six? Darn it. Um, how many do I have? Five, probably. This Temi! Damn, I just went through the entire map, and I was not able to find a sixth dog. The dogs are actually super well hidden, because, I mean, there are one, like, this one, for example, is super obvious. But then there are others which are, like, in the background. I'm so sure there's gonna be a dog somewhere on the top here, in this area. But I just can't find anyone. And this doesn't count as a dog, of course. It would be funny if, like, all the dogs on the map counted as dogs. That you can find. Okay, seriously? Wait. Seriously? I never found this one? This little chubby one right there in the corner? That's so obvious. Wait, like you even go up. Like I, I, I look at the at this little pyramid thing. I look around. I never found this cute thing there. Surprising. But there we go. Temi. <laughs> 
Temmy versus the dogs, I guess. Temmy, I helped you. Let's go. Nice, thanks for all. But five mysticals would be better. I'm sorry, but maybe I guess mysticals could actually be better than all of that work. But hey, we did it, right? Hey, you collected the fireworks. Yeah, okay, okay, we did it. Hooray! You saved Santa from the fireworks. Now Santa wants to meet you. And you need to get from him the last part of the tree. The star at the top. I'm scared. Is this gonna be a fight? Oh, you are the one who saved me from my death? Look at this, dude! What? Thank you a lot. What is this song? Are you gonna... Oh, give me my presents. I have HP. Really? Santa? Are you joking? Why is Santa evil? I, I don't even... I'm speechless. I don't know what to say to this. Jingle bell! Whoa, Santa? Hey, Santa, calm down. C c Santa? Wah! Oh my god, you are a monster. Again? Really? Um, um, um... Ugh. Oh god, Santa. This is my... These are my Christmas presents. Uh, Santa? Oh god, this isn't that bad. I have to go in between and then left. You're looking so evil too. Like, you're not looking like a nice Santa. Is it really getting harder and harder? Oh, 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 oh my god. Uh, I need to change side eventually. Oh, right! Oh, wait, I'm so dumb. I was still thinking about the Halloween event where you only have one HP. You're very bad. I'm not bad. <gasps> what the heck? Santa? Um. Okay, you know what? Okay, first of all, Amalgamate is ready. Sure. What I think is that it's gonna be like Halloween where half or maybe maybe half of the battle is just dialogue. So it's not gonna be like impossible for me. But it's still gonna be really freaking tough. Hey, there we go. Okay, round two. Um, so the first like few attacks aren't bad at all. I think really the the only thing that went crazy was right when we failed and like took three HP damage in a row pretty much. Because this I mean, I guess I don't have to wait. I just have to wait for that, like, okay, wait. I don't have to wait. I just have to wait, logic. But I should wait for the best moment. But I shouldn't, like, ugh, extend the wait time for too long. Okay, and these are the Christmas presents. Here again, just avoid. And as soon as you see an opening, a good one. Oh my god, that was not a good opening. Is it random? Like, it felt like the Christmas presents are homing in on your position, kind of. But maybe not. Maybe it really is just random and I got extremely lucky. Okay, this is... This is hard! I think it's never able to hit you here. It's definitely hard because, yeah, the presence can ninja attack you. But... I'm gonna try it like this. I'm gonna try to just stay on the right side. It doesn't seem like a lot of projectiles actually reach this area. Darn it. I dodged right into it. Ah, but we're still good. We're still good. Holy moly. Is that it? Lights out? Darn it! Okay, now I'm scared. I, I think there's... Uh, that was bad. So wait until it switches direction and go here. Okay, and now just hope that the presents aren't too evil. Go down as much as possible so you have the most time to react to a present. And then when you see it, go left like that. Oh, that was awesome. Okay, again. It's scary because you want to focus on all the other, like, Christmas balls and stuff. But don't. Don't. Definitely don't. Only focus on the red and black presents. Well, okay, that was kind of dumb. But... Two HP left. The pattern is still the same. I think I died there last time, which makes no sense. Like, this is really easy. So maybe if I do it now... Is it, is it really that it? I don't believe you because that... I don't really have anything to throw you out. Come on, one present. Come on, Santa. I've been nice. A bomb will explode everything if you won't do something. What is wrong with you, Santa? You're a monster. You're so evil. Can I click you away? Oh. Oh, that. You look like a melon. Are you a secret melon? 
You killed Santa Claus? Good job! What is this game? Was I not supposed to do that? Oh! Oh, wait! Oh, I did it! Hey, buddy! Hello? You killed Santa. I'm sorry! I didn't even know that would happen! We hate you. We won't have any presents this year. I'm so sorry! But if you didn't know that... Oh, it gives you... 50,000. Oh! Okay, wait, 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 what's happening? Tell me. I'm scared. Please let it be something good. It's a new tree right from the forest. Oh! So I can retry it, you mean? You can decorate the tree again if you want to. Decorate everything? Only for two New Year tokens. I don't think I have any tokens right now. Goodbye! Goodbye, regular game studios! Thank you! You fully decorated the tree. I have the star. That's nice. And you completed the event. Done! That's it! Wait, so if I go to S to my profile... That is actually it! Now I wonder, is there really a pacifist route? Or does Santa just kill you with the time bomb? And now I'm Sans! Oh, now I have the rank rewards! That's cool! I'm Sans now, that is awesome. So I can't do anything here anymore. So what if I go to this main screen, to the black market, special? Um, I don't have anything, a new tree or a new year token machine. I definitely want that because that's like the fun thing, very special. Um, oh wait, that was wrong, sorry. Uh, I think I'm gonna open like a few wooden rewards just to see if there's anything good inside here. That's dust. Eh, okay. Not a lot of dust, but I still like it. That is a token. You know what? I'm gonna use the token immediately because I want to use that token machine. Let's go! And... Hey! We have this music again. It's the same thing again, I think. We just have to, you know, cross our fingers, hope for something good. Maybe... Maybe some mystical boxes, maybe some dust, maybe some damage. This is it. The moment of truth. Silver and two gold? Five golden boxes. Wait, golden? Okay, yeah, not epic. I always think of like golden because it's yellow, but this is the golden one. So, uh, that's good. I'm gonna open up one more wooden reward and see if I can get anything great. That is love. 50 million love in one wooden reward. And then let's just open like two golden ones, I think. That's okay. That's a lot of dust. 80 dust. Okay. Okay. I'm, I'm happy with that. Totally happy with that. What is gonna be inside here? Love per second. That's not that amazing, but okay. Then let's open like three mystical boxes too. Let's make a little box opening, I guess. That's multiplayer points. That's pretty. It's making me pretty happy because you can get like unique cursor icons for that. Those are quest cards. Always useful. And then the last mystical box. And then after this reward, which is love per second. Okay. We will open our last epic reward box as the finale for the opening. What is gonna be our final epic impossible reward? Let's go. It is damage. Five extra damage. Okay, we're ending these epic boxes with damage. I'm gonna open these like eventually later, but for now, one thing that I think we still kind of want to do. Um, I mean, we are here. I think I'm gonna save the entire new home, new area for a next episode. I'm, I, I, it's gonna be a teaser to see this is new home. We're gonna go there next time. It's gonna be exciting, but I'm not gonna show it yet. I'm gonna leave it as a teaser. But what I can do is go to the rank rewards and at least open up to like level 10 at least, just to see. I'm guessing, yeah, this is gonna be wooden. Wooden. Is it only gonna be wooden until level 10? Oh, we actually have silver. And silver. Um... So, there are many things that we can look forward to in the future. The rank rewards, we can of course open more boxes, and we can do the new home storyline. I can also try to redo the Christmas event, because maybe there's an alternate ending for that event. But for now, guys, that was a really fun episode, a super fun Christmas event, really nice way to come back to Clickertail 2. Thanks for watching, guys, I hope you liked the video. And until next time, 
Take care.